I'm Amanda Smith here at Cromwell Field, where the offense took on the defense in a players-only practice, and we spoke to senior safety T.J. McDonald. Okay, so you recently made the decision to stay here at USC for another year. Can you tell me what your reason was behind that? Uh, this is a lot of reasons. Um, one, these guys out here that are on the field with me, um, that couldn't stop thinking about those guys uh, the whole time I was home and, and thinking about the whole thing. And two, uh, you know, I want to get my degree. I got a lot of stuff that I still want to finish here at SC, and you know, we got a good chance to, to do some great things next year, and I want to be a part of that. Now, you and Barkley made a decision relatively around the same time. Did you guys talk at all about that? Yeah, we talked. We talked, and uh, I mean, we're real close. I mean, he's one of my best friends on this team. We uh, we talked through the whole situation, and we knew that. Um, you know, this opportunity that we have in front of us doesn't come along, around very often, and we know that uh, we, can, we have a, we have an opportunity to do some great things. And uh, both of us felt the same as far as you know, we want to be a part of this, and we wanted to be, we went, didn't want to be those guys. Cut the story short, and wanted to finish out what we started, and uh, that's what we're doing. Okay, so considering that you could be playing with some NFL guys right now, how does it feel playing, playing with a lot of younger guys? Uh, it's fun. I mean, it's fun just because, you know, I still kind of have my youth right now. And, you know, when you go to the NFL, it's a business, and it's, it's serious. And, and these guys are, you know, all my buddies. And, and, you know, you go to the next level, you can't you can't hit one of your boys up and be like, well, you know, what you doing? You know, you want to play some video games or something like that. You got to just um, – it's all business. But uh, me being able to – I mean, I'm, I'm 21, and I'm, I'm, I'm still – still young and I still feel like I got a lot of stuff to prove here at SC and not just football wise but uh, getting my degree is something that um, is really important to me and my family and uh, you know to be out here with these guys means a lot. Uh, what have off-season workouts been like for you? Uh, they've been brutal. I mean, we, we haven't slowed down at all, and uh, we got, we've got big. There's a lot of weight that's on our shoulders right now. Not to say that that's pressure, but with that weight comes, you know, a lot of dedication, and you got to be able to work, and you got to put the work in. So uh, we know that nothing's going to come easy, um, but the opportunity that's in front of us is, is so big that, you know, the way that we work really reflects, you know, what we, what, what we have a chance to do. Now, since you are older, what kind of leadership role have you taken on with the team? Um, I'm not doing anything different than I did last year. I mean, uh, I feel like I, I, we did a pretty good job leading last year, and uh, I feel like if you ask the, you know, some of the, my teammates, they probably say the same thing. And uh, you know, we all have the same goal. So it's not just me. It's not just Matt. It's a lot of guys out here that have the same goal, and they, we all want to do something great. And uh, you know, and, and j us coming back here to do that, um, you know, excites those guys. And, and, and I mean, I, they were so responsive to everything, and it was it was a real good feeling to me to know that uh, those guys care so much, and for us to come back and and you know, I really don't have to do too much, but you know, be a good example and. And you know, hopefully, you know, make some good plays for the team, and, and uh, hopefully, lead us to to a great season. So, since you have decided to stay, that means that some other players might have to delay their start. So, how do you encourage them to? give that their morale and keep them going? I don't think that I really have to encourage them just because these guys, I mean, of course, everyone wants to play, but, uh, you know, from, from, from what I've heard from them is they get another chance to learn. You know, they get a chance to sit back and, and learn, not just foot, from the football aspect, but how to lead, you know, how to do and the little things. And this is a team that, you know, we've, we've kind of been in the closet, you know, for a couple of years, and uh, now we're ready to get out. And these guys that, you know, that are still waiting their turn, uh, that's, that comes with the territory. When you come here, there's great players here. They're the best players are going to be on the field. And for the guys that uh, you know are going to wait their turn, you know when they get off the field, I'm going to know that I'm going to be Arthur cheering them on. And uh, and uh, if, if if God willing, and nothing happens, you know, to me or anything like that, they'll be ready. You know, so I got to make sure that uh, everybody's ready, and uh, you're just one snap away from getting on that field, regardless of what position you play. Okay, and last question: Since USC is going to make a big premiere on the national scene this year because they do have a chance to play in bowl games, how has that made the team more enthusiastic about playing? I mean, we've been. I don't think it's, it's just the, the the word bowl. I mean, it's, it means a lot to this team just because we've been at home watching all these teams playing these bowl games for the last two years. I mean, that stuff hurts. And that stuff, knowing that, you know, we feel like we're better than some of those teams or we could play with a lot of those teams and we had to sit at home and watch it knowing that, you know, none of us were the reason for, you know, any of that stuff. You know, that stuff has just been building up and we're definitely going to be playing with a chip on our shoulder like we have been. And because this is our opportunity is now, you know, we got to seize that. And we know that that comes with a lot of work. You know, we're just putting that work in now. Signing out from Cromwell Field, this is Amanda Smith and log on to uscfootball.com.